Yeah. Yeah. And you're, you've been sounding the alarm on that. And so have other people like Raven's cry. Mm -hmm. Like a lot yeah. of people are talking about that. Yeah. Yeah. So it's just, it's a matter of timing, but that's, it's definitely, I've had, I think one of the most significant precognitive dreams I've ever had was, and this is a really long time ago, was before my brother died. And so the, I'm in my 20s. This is a long time ago. I had a dream where me and my brother were hanging out and he's my older brother. He's a year older than me. We were just, we were hanging out. We were having so much fun. We were standing on tall buildings and flying off of them and just it was just this beautiful dream of flying around and just having so much fun. It was like we didn't have the limitations of our bodies while we were doing this. It was like we just enjoying flying around and being free from our bodies. We could fly. And then at some point, all of a sudden, we were in, in the same dream. We were in Denny, 